An Arkansas cop last Sunday morning spotted a suspicious car parked outside a commercial storage facility that was broken into 16 times this year. Okay. A sheriff's deputy noted that the vehicle in question was seen, quote, rocking about 12.45 a.m. Well, we all know the rule about rocking, don't we? Uh, when the cop looked inside the automobile, he spotted Theodore Morgaven, 55 years old, quote, having sex with a stuffed animal. Morgaven, a divorced father of three, which is relevant, obviously, lives about a mile away from the storage facility. Since Morgaven is on probation, cops were able to search him and his automobile without the need for a warrant. According to a probable cause affidavit, the search turned up methamphetamines, a syringe, and two marijuana pipes. Well, he looks like the kind of guy that would fuck a stuffed animal. Um, he was charged with two felony drug charges, a misdemeanor uh, count of public sexual indecence, and the possession of drug paraphernalia. My question to you guys is just simply this. Isn't fucking a stuffed animal a victimless crime? A man's free to jack it in the back seat of his car if he so chooses, or bang a... <laughs> A fair-sized teddy bear if he wins one. It's a victimless crime. So if it's a victimless thing, how Did is you interview the, the bear? <laughs> <laughs> and here comes Johnny Law, like, let's go check the... Po oh. Let what you doing in there? Uh, I was just... I was fluffing the teddy bear for my daughter tomorrow. <laughs> I'm a ventriloquist. I've been practicing. <laughs> <laughs> America is built on like you're only committing a crime if you're hurting somebody else. Yeah. And we we've changed those rules. We've changed those rules. Mm -hmm. And so like now the rules are like if we can if we can pop you for everything we will. If I want to cut a little teeny tiny hole in old I kept saying Teddy Ruxpin, I don't know, but maybe my buddy or <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's much worse. <laughs> yeah, 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 All right, terrible. kid sister, fine. Uh, <laughs> it's it's two consenting fucking adult stuffed animals. <laughs> it's a consenting adult and a consenting stuffed animal. It's perfectly fine in my book. Like I said, I, I, he didn't really break any laws other than maybe what a decent exposure or some bullshit because he was doing what? it in his car. Think about a lot of the, the type of cops we got. We got these hyper masculine dudes. Fucking, can you imagine some fucking roided up testosterone fucking jar ex jarhead fucking cop taps on the thing? He's like, look at look at this gay guy fucking a teddy bear. I'm gonna beat the shit out of him, throw him in jail. Like they, we just don't have the the climate is not here for it anymore. Like community policing back in the day. Hey, Randy, come on, man, go home to your wife. Fucking yeah, I I, I just I I really wish that policing in this country would be more like. Hey, buddy, you know you shouldn't be doing that, right? Yeah. yeah. Go home. All right. Do you have a home? No. All right. Pull behind C6 and finish up. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, help him out. Yeah. Something. If it was done Teddy style, not doggy, not missionary, not reverse cowgirl, what but, is dog, but Teddy exactly? style, he just spins it around 60 degrees over and over again. Yeah. What's he saying, though? Are you hibernating? I bet you aren't. <laughs> I'm going to give you some honey. <laughs> Put you to sleep for four months. Never tried that. <laughs> sweet, sweet honey. Put some salmon eggs in you. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs>